What is up YouTube, it's Bunny Films here, and today we are in Lumber Taker 2, and we're going to be building a wood detector keycard door, so, yeah, it's just a keycard door, so, all you need for this, it's actually pretty simple, but you do have to go to Link's Logic, and that could be a hassle, and to get all this, or to get this signal delay, and the, um, sig the wood detector, you need to go to Link's Logic, you have to ride that ferry over there, and that should be there, um, there should be a store there. So you have to buy those. This is pretty expensive. It did cost $11,000. This, I don't know, because I got that from a donation. But anyways, we're going to be going over how to build a keycard door. So all you need, well, first, um, you need to have a, we're going to do this with the regular door, so that, it makes it a bit more difficult, but I think it does look pretty nice. So, you need to have a door built, and if you're doing hatches, it might be a little different, but it's, it's basically the same concept we're doing. But, you need to have a little hole, and to find that hole is, you have to open your door, and you want to make sure that the, you can have your wire connect to the little door handle here. So, you want, because like, you need to connect this wire to the door handle, so you need to make sure it's reaching that. And then on this side, you need to have a little hole here, it needs to be um, two studs open. Two studs wide, it could be smaller, but it wouldn't really work out really well. So, you need, for the build, you need five regular wires, you need one wood detector, you need one signal delay, and then you need three four by, or two by two blueprints. These are just small floors. So, with these blueprints, let's just do this really quickly. Place one there. Oh gosh, it's lagging a bit. I don't think I placed. No. We can just fill another one, guys, in. So, you're going to place one down there. You're going to place one up here. We're going to have to fill in that glitch blueprint. So it's a small floor. There we go. We have the power to build these. That should not be any difficult. There we go. Or at all difficult. I don't know. But you're going to place one there. There we go. So it should look like this. Because you want to be able to put your wood in there like this. Like that. You want it, that. You want it to work like that. So next you want to get your wood detector. And then you don't want to put it facing this way. That's why we have it like this. Because then the laser would stick out. And yeah, this makes a laser so it wouldn't look nice. Just having a random laser. So you want to place that there. There we go. And then it won't work until we put a piece of wood in it. So what I did, I got some really, really rare wood from which I think it's this wood. Yeah. So this wood is all the way from across the ferry. It's like light brown. It's not brown from this biome over here the safari it's from all the way across there so most people probably do not have it and if you want to make it vip access you have to give these to your friends little wood pieces and when they put the piece of wood in front of the laser it would let them in so let's put you have to put the little piece inside the hole in here for it to work and now it's activated because you see this little laser so now let's just stick this piece in like this there we go so when you stick that in this little thing turns on and when it's not in there it is off so, next, you want to take your signal delay. I'm just going to put it like this. So, yeah. And then you want to set it to max setting. So, it's already set there. You can just toggle it by pressing E on this little time capsule. Or time. Uh, sand time thing. I'm not sure what it's called. So, then you want to run a wire from this down. And then to the signal delay thing. So, place that there. There we go. So, that should run the delay when it's done. So next, we're gonna take another wire, and this time we're actually we need to actually um, cl open the door. So you have to stand here. There we go. So you can touch it or you can connect it there. So place this here. Go here. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna try to make this as neat as possible. So then you want to go here. Go. Oh, let's just go here. You want to go up and connect it to the door handle. So now let's test it. So let's get this piece of wood. Let's put it in here. Come on. There we go. That should run to the delay and the door should close. Come on. Um, is it going to close? Oh, there we go. So that was just a long delay. But that's all right. You can toggle that if you want to. So it does work. So let's close this and open it from back here. And now let's see. Let's take this out of here now, and now we have to do um, something to close or to open the door. So, what this might not be very neat, but you can like you can put it under a floor or something, make it nicer. So, you need to connect a wire uh, that runs right here. Oh wait, no, runs right here on this side of the signal detector, and you need to make wait, come on. You want to make it so that it runs through that little hole as well. So, 
we go like this, go up. There we go. And then you want to have this side. You want to go down here. Um, let's have this run to the here. Then we're going to go down. We're going to go over, but we just ran out of space. So that's what we're going to use our last um, wire for. Wait, we have two wire. Oh, it's glitched. No. Or am I just lagging? Okay, yeah, I was just lagging. Spawned back in. So now we're going to take one more wire. We might have one extra wire, because I was using it, neon wires originally, and that was a bit short. So, um, I mean, neon wires are not as big as, um, like, the other wires. So that that's how it should look like so far. So, I mean, that isn't pretty neat, but you can change it however you want. But it's going to open up. You can walk through. So, there we go. Let's close that. Now, let's test it out. So, we have that rare wood in there. Now, uh, bike honor. Um, thank you for joining. So, if we put this in here, and then you can take it out. And hop over here. Wait for the door to open. Why is it not opening? Hold on. I, I hope that wire is connected. Oh, it's not connected. That's why it's not working. Wait. Wait. Hold on. Oh, dang it. So, this wire was not connected properly. Let's try this again. So, if we go here. Wait, what? We, I'm just going to go on top of here. Oh, dang it. Come on. Let's place this here. Then let's go up and down again. There we go. Okay. So, now we're back to normal, so let's, let's place this up here. Let's get this through here. Like this. Come on. There we go. Wait, hold on. Let's, can we make this better or more simple? There we go. Okay, that's better. So now we can go down here. Go over here. Hopefully this connects, and it does. So we'll finish that. Now it should work. Yeah, that's connected now. So now the door... Should open, there we go. So let's close this, we have to take the piece of wood out, it's gonna open up again. Yep, there we go. So, let's close it, now let's test this out. So, we wanna make sure that it's all turned off and stuff, everything's turned off, so let's wait for the delay to expire really quickly. Just to give you a, give you a um, spook wood in base of, oh, my spook wood from fans. Thank you for the gifts, people who gave them. So, now it's like refreshed now. So now, if we stick this in here like this, there we go. The door should open. Wait, we need the key, though. You have to take the key with you. So we take that, it turns off, and it closes. Boom, guys. So I hope you did enjoy this video. We have built a little signal detector door. If you're having trouble, um, just comment in the comment section below. I'll try to answer your in inquiry. I'm trying to sound fancy. It's just question, inquiry, question, same thing. So guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you did enjoy it. hope you did learn something. If you built this, share it with me on Twitter at bunnyfilms1. I think that's what it is. So guys, have a great day. Subscribe if you want to stay tuned for more tutorials and default to upcoming game. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.